So here's the essential phone. The, it was the first truly bezel-less, right? Phone. Yes, yes, yeah. on, on Android for sure. So. Um, so hi, so who are you? Uh, I'm Marcus. Uh, I'm the EPM at uh, Essential in the software team. So I'm walking you guys through the device a little bit today. And it has a nice screen. It goes all the way to the corners. Yes, yes. So you can notice here we have this camera notch uh, in the middle of the screen here. And we have built our UI to accommodate the camera notch around that so you get the best experience in full screen mode for your proprietary apps. And then uh, um, users also moving forward will be able to customize this experience. So, so some Google apps around. are like whitelisted for the Yeah, notch? so for example, we have like Google Hangouts, for example, you can see here at the top where how we work around the camera bezel. And we work with our um, with third-party app developers as well to make sure that um, they're either developing their apps to support the uh, the bezel or that we get them whitelisted from the beginning so they actually can run around the bezel that we have. In, in and if here. they're not whitelisted, then it's a black They're order. letterboxed. So I'll, I'll see if I can find an example of an app that is letterboxed here uh, on my phone. Um, let's see here. What do I have that's in this letterbox mode? Here's a good example. So this, this my GMC app, you can see this little black box at the top here. So that is a representative of an app that is not whitelisted. So we'll have, just like before, we, which basically just means we run the, the, the application in a, in a letterbox mode where you, you maintain the status bar, the Google status bar as it is. So apps that are whitelisted will utilize that full space. So like for videos and stuff like that can run in full screen, etc. And uh, what's the quality of the front-facing camera? Uh, this is eight megapixel front-facing yeah. camera, so uh, autofocus, everything. Uh, yeah, yeah, it does yeah. that as part of the the stock configuration, and we have we're continuing to improve the APIs as we do, we have software updates that we push out through the Play Store. So our camera app is always constantly being updated. Also, the back camera is getting better and better. Yes, yes, as well. So we just add, we added portrait mode uh, on the back camera uh, not too long ago. So that's a new feature. And we have a, a roadmap of features which. Um, we'll continue to roll out new features. Does the portrait mode have a super nice uh, bokeh? Yeah, well, we can yeah, show it to you right now. Is actually so. Um, take, maybe you can take picture. Yeah, um, yeah, for yeah. sure. So so let's, uh, let me uh, focus on you here. I'll get the bokeh. Okay. So is it full of bokeh? Yeah, you can see the blur around the back here. The motion blur where. Cameras, you can see the phone in the background is kind of blurred. So, all right. So, um, and uh, what's the size of the screen? Uh, the screen size is oh, I have to pull up the exact is spec. Five ninety nine inch. Jason would know. Where's Keith? Yeah. 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 But uh, so, but you probably have to say minus the notch. When well, we're looking size. in preview. We're looking in preview mode right now. So, like, this is letterboxing for the sake of the shot, but I can actually zoom it in to see the full. One, one thing I hope, maybe for the next generation, I think the camera could just be in the bottom right here and people can flip the phone when they do selfies. That would be my opinion. But yeah, it's certainly, it's certainly a possibility. Something. Because it's such an amazing thing to have a screen that goes all the way. Mm -hmm. It's just, because I don't mind to have a bezel down here. I mean, it makes sense. Mm -hmm. If people want to do more and more stuff with the bezel where, I mean, you want to have a, a what's called a, maybe you want to have this fancy kind of like face Thing, uh, yeah, like a or, yeah, yeah, like an AR kind of front-facing AR and stuff. Uh, then the space for whatever you want to do down mm -hmm. here. Yeah, so exactly. You can just flip. If, if people want to do a lot of, um, does a UI flip? Yeah, the UI flips. I have I have the device rotation locked right now. So um, let's see here. If I pull up a an application here, that runs in landscape. I don't know. Actually, I don't think yeah. um, that particular app does not run in landscape. Um, but yeah, so. Uh, of course, all the Google proprietary apps, they all run in... Yeah. Um, and also on the head. Yes, exactly. All the, way up. all the way around also too. Oh, you mean completely yeah. upside down? Yeah, this is still in letterbox yeah. mode. So it, I think we only, have, we only have the landscape and portrait mode. Okay. Um, I, there's, that's a setting though in Android. We could turn yeah. that on if I wanted to. But So how's battery life? Uh, battery life is really good. So we get about uh, anywhere from 40 hours standby time to uh, you know, 20, 20 hours talk time as well. So it just depends on obviously a lot of factors like screen brightness, yeah. you know, if you're, if you're running Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, et cetera. Yeah. So. And uh, if you look on the back, so what's the material you're using there? It's like a... So this is, this is ceramic on the back and titanium on the sides. So you see here, that's nice little, this, 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 so we're looking at titanium here on the side and then this is a ceramic uh, and I believe that's a glass covering on the ceramic, is that Titanium, correct? this is like one of those very strong ones? Yes, yeah, it's light. strong and light. 
strong and light. Light and stainless, I believe, as well. All so. right. And, and uh, finger, uh, fingerprintness? Yes. Uh, well, the, the, that, it would, the, the so that black, if you look at this one, this one actually yeah. would be, we'll give you that finger, um, uh, the non, non, non fingerprinty. Yeah. Uh, so the, what are these colors that we're looking at right here? For example, this one. So this is Ocean Depths, yeah. blue. This is the one we have right there. Yeah, any chance yeah. you can uh, and take them off? And yeah, this is copper yeah. black. So you can unplug this. Has some right. gold? Yeah, I see that nice. Uh, is copper. That copper. Copper. Copper, yeah. Any, any golden versions? No. With real yeah. gold? And you no. also see on the around the fingerprint sensor as well as that gold or that copper ring as well. All right. That's yeah, a really beautiful device. And that one is a. Uh, this is ocean depth here on the this blue one. And the copper on the sides too. Uh, this yeah. is copper on the, yeah. on the sides as well. And uh, those colors here are available on the, on your website or? Yes, these two just launched. Is that correct? These the, three are available on essential.com for five ninety nine, and the halo gray is four ninety nine. It's exclusive to Amazon. And the uh, halo gray is a. Uh, one on the far left. one over there. Uh, so this is how it looks mm -hmm. right here. Uh, with the silvery sides? Titanium on the side, it's brushed titanium. $4.99 is a good price. Yes, $4.99 is, is, is also the cost of the pure white and the black nice. So this is a half the price of a iPhone X, right? Yeah. yeah. So why, is people, why are people buying iPhone X? That's a, well, that's a good that's question. A question for Apple. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That should um, be your slogan. Yeah, yeah. I'm just giving you ideas. Okay, cool. That's awesome. So Great. How, how I think actually I have to pull. I have to pull Marcus oh. into another meeting. Okay. So I think that's all the time we have. Oh, okay, cool. I'm just, just gonna for one sure. second. I'm just gonna check right here because yep. it says uh, Lighthouse is a uh, uh, what is the security camera? It's a smart home security camera. Smart home security smart camera home solution. Company, portfolio companies for playground. Nice. And here's a really cool looking uh, owl. The owl. That is a video conferencing device. With a 360 4K? Or, uh, I don't know if it's 4K. And it does video conferencing. It, it points to the people around the table it automatically. It's speaking yes. and it focuses on the person. Nice. Who's talking, yeah. And what does this one do? Hero is mesh Wi Fi. Um, nice. So it helps. Have a better Wi Fi. Wi Fi yeah. over your 